Welcome back to the video. So today we have rivals and foot champions rewards. The team of the week is looking uh, pretty decent. There's a few good players and then there's obviously the the bad ones. So quickly, if we look, uh, De Gea is obviously, in my opinion, the best one in here. Uh, you could say Suarez, but they're both really, really good. Fabinho's good. Um, this Pepe card has a nice card. I probably I wouldn't use him, but I could sub him on. And then Anaki Williams looks decent. Pedro would be good for an SBC. Um, Parejo for an SPC would be great and then Rufia is my keeper right now so I really want him and then this the Janine card has a nice card so um, yeah we, uh, we'll open up Division Rival or like claim them we'll take the untradeables you know because uh, you got rank 1 and you want to get the most packs you can so 4 general gold packs no general premium gold packs and then 250k's and 235 and then the points for we can need for the for relevant and then we got gold two and foot champions. I was one win off uh, gold one, skirted, uh, but can't do much about that. And then we get one of four foot champions players twice, and then rare gold pack, rare mega pack, and 45k. So we'll open up the player picks first. Hopefully, we can get someone decent out of one of the two. I never get any anyone good, literally. We do get the Janini. I said he has a decent card. He has a really good card. Four star, four star. Uh, 6 foot 3 and then 82 acceleration, 90 speed, 89 finishing, 80, 89 uh, attack position, 89, 87 shot power, 89 stamina, 88 strength, good agility, we'll take him. <laughs> oh dear! Yes! Oh my god! Yes! Come on! Oh, this is a bad thing. I never get anyone good. 92 uh, diving, 88 handling, 90 kicking, 96 reflexes, and 91 positioning. Wow, six foot four. He's a beast. He's one of the best keeps on the game, if not the best, or Courtois. So, yeah, very, very happy with that. I don't care who I get now. Wow, I actually, I always get really bad player picks. I'm not exaggerating. I always get bad player picks. I'm gonna skip through these jumbo goal packs. Hopefully, uh, one of them is good. They always seem to be bad for me, so don't really care about them. Uh, you don't really want to look at the jumbo gold packs when you've got like 50k packs and stuff in there. So the bender, um, 24 is all. Uh, no duplicates in that one. Two of these left. So happy we've got um, a uh, decent red player. Well, not decent, brilliant red player pick. Given there's 84, that's nice actually. Good for an SBC. But yeah, like I said, I literally never get anyone out of player picks. Super Sitch 83 and Lucas 82. Not too bad. And then the stadium will get quick sold. So now we're on to a rare gold pack. These are always also bad for me. No walkouts, we'll skip that as well. Could be a board though, obviously. And it isn't 79 rated. They're always bad. They're always shocking. So I just wouldn't advise opening them. Then we got 250Ks, we'll do the Mega Packs first, 250Ks, 235s, and then uh, 255s, so we'll do the two Megas first. Oh, I've skipped the walkout. Oh my god, who's it going to be? Ericsson, and an Inform. I'd take that. Ericsson I'll be using into an SBC, only because he won't get into my team. But the Inform also I can use into a, uh, a different SBC. So Ericsson and Inform is a great mega pack and uh, it is untradeable. But like I said, I'll use that Ericsson into an SBC. So uh, very happy with that. And then uh, quick sell that Everton kit. Now we've got another mega pack. I try not to skip it if it is a walkout. I was just waiting for it. Right, like, this one is, isn't a walkout. So we are going to skip it. 